Hey guys, how you doing? This is your friend Alex, and today I'm going to show you how to unlock your iPhone XR locked to AT&T. But please watch this video from the beginning until the end so you don't miss any of the important tips that I'm going to give you. How can I know this iPhone is locked? If you go to settings, general, about here under carrier lock, you're going to see SIM lock. And it says this device might be restricted to the original carrier and or have certain capabilities limited. Contact your provider for more info. Another way that we can know that this device is locked is you're going to put a SIM card from a carrier different than AT&T. In this case, I have a SIM card from Mint Mobile. Let's put it here and let's see what happened. Activation required. Dismiss. Hello. Software update complete. Activation required again software app they complete i'm running 16.4.1 which is the latest ios version it may take a few minutes to activate your iphone this iphone is connected to wi-fi so right now the iphone is connected to the server and this is the result sim not supported the sim that you currently have installed in this iphone is from a carrier that is not supported under the activation policy that is currently assigned by the activation server this is not a hardware issue with the iphone please install another sim from a supported carrier or request that this iphone be unlocked by your carrier please contact apple for more information in order to continue i need to take out the sim card so now that i don't have the sim card i'm going to go to settings general about and i'm going to copy the imei number you see there are two the second one is an eSIM. the first one is the one that we need we already copy and now we're gonna go to our browser and we're gonna search for AT&T unlock and this is the website that we need AT&T.com forward slash device unlock I'm gonna put a link on the description so you don't miss out from here you need to read all of this stuff because in order to get the unlock your phone needs to qualify okay and then you click submit and unlock request do you have a mobile number from AT&T I don't. IMEI number, I mean, you're going to click on paste, and immediately the AT&T portal is going to recognize the phone as the iPhone XR A1984. You're going to click on I read the legal info, and then next. Here we're going to put our information. I'm sorry, Alex Sniga. Mobile number, don't put anything. Email address is the most important part. Right there. And then I'm going to click submit. And he says, thanks, we got your request. So they are going to send me an email with a link that I need to click in order to continue the process. This is a process handled by the server, okay? Here I'm going to go to Gmail and I'm going to log into my email, okay? And it's weird, I still don't get the email from AT&T, guys. This usually is really fast. All right, guys, so the other day I tried to unlock this iPhone XR locked to AT&T and the server for some reason was not giving me that email that I need to confirm, right? So I wait a couple of days and I got the emails. So here is the first email that I needed to confirm and I confirm it and then I got the email saying that they approved my unlock request, okay? But I didn't turn on the phone since then. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna turn on this iPhone XR and I'm gonna disable Wi-Fi so you can see that it should say SIM lock and then I'm going to enable Wi-Fi and then the server is going to send the signal to this iPhone to be unlocked. So I wanted to show you this. I hope I can capture. So let's see. This one is already approved, guys. They approved my unlock request. So I'm going to turn off Wi-Fi really quick so you can see, guys. Right now, I don't have any SIM card on this iPhone. Yeah, no SIM card, okay? So really quick, I'm going to go here and I'm going to turn off the Wi-Fi, okay? Let me go to general about... And look at this, guys. This is what I wanted to show you. Listen, carrier lock, SIM lock. This iPhone was SIM lock by AT&T, but I requested the unlock using the website, which I showed you before, and they approved my unlock, but they took an extra day to send that email to confirm. A lot of people are asking me, hey, I never got the email confirmation. I never got the link that I need to click. Since all this process is automatic, sometimes the server, they get loaded, they get updates, sometimes they are slow, whatever reason it is. So right now, you're not getting the confirmation email right away. Usually, once you send that request, you get the email like in the next three to five minutes okay but now it's taking longer so please be patient and then as soon as you get the email confirm it and they're going to give you an answer a yes or a no okay but i do wanted to show you this i was lucky that i captured carrier lock still at sim lock they already approved my request okay so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to connect to the wi-fi and automatically the server is going to send the signal to this iphone saying that it's unlocked 
So that's why all this happening through the server, this is a permanent unlock. A lot of people are asking me, how long this unlock is gonna last? Once you get this unlock from AT&T, this unlock is forever, all right? I'm gonna turn on the Wi-Fi, and hopefully you're gonna be able to see, guys, how this is gonna turn into unlock. No SIM restrictions. I'm gonna turn on the Wi-Fi. I'm gonna go back to the settings. Carrier lock. I'm gonna put a Mint Mobile SIM card, put it like that, and then I'm gonna put it here on the XR, and that's gonna trigger the unlock, okay? It says SIM lock now, it needs to change to no SIM restrictions, okay? Still at SIM lock, let me try again. General about. No SIM restrictions, guys. As soon as I put the Ultra Mint Mobile SIM card, this one changed from SIM lock to no SIM restrictions. Okay. And that's a confirmation that this phone is 100% unlocked now. 611. Supposed to call the Mint Fox. Looks like you were trying to make a call, but your plan has expired and needs to be renewed. To make a payment and renew your plan, press 1. Or if you would like to make a payment later at mintmobile.com or in the Mint Mobile app, press 2. And that's it. That's a confirmation that this phone is 100% unlocked. I show you the SIM lock and I show you now the no SIM restrictions. So this is what you want to see, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you like it. Please don't forget to subscribe because that's the best way you can support my channel. Without your support, my channel is going to die. Thank you.